What are the layers that form anterior abdominal wall medial to linea semilunaris? Skin, superficial fascia, anterior lamina of rectus sheath, rectus abdominis muscle, posterior lamina of rectus sheath, transversalis fascia, extraperitoneal fat, extraperitoneal connective tissue, parietal peritoneum. What is caput medusa? Dilated tortuous superficial veins radiating from umbilicus. How it occurs in portal hypertension? There is a portosystemic anastomosis between paraumbilical veins, which are tributaries of portal vein, and superior and inferior epigastric veins, which are tributaries of inferior vena cava. Increased pressure in portal system opens this anastomosis, so superficial veins around umbilicus get dilated and appear as caput medusae. Tell me some other clinical features of portal hypertension. Hematemesis, melina, distended abdomen, enlargement of liver and spleen. Why is abdomen distended? Because increased hydrostatic pressure in capillaries leads to accumulation of serous fluid in peritoneal cavity. What are the other portosystemic anastomoses? Anastomosis between esophageal branches of left gastric vein and esophageal veins of esophagus system. Anastomosis between superior rectal branch of left gastric vein and inferior rectal veins draining into internal iliac vein via internal pudendal tributary. Anastomosis between portal branches in the liver and veins of the diaphragm across the bare area of the liver. Anastomosis between portal tributaries in mesentery and mesocolon and retroperitoneal veins. What is the location of gallbladder? It is situated in a fossa on the inferior surface of right lobe of liver. The fundus of gallbladder can be found at the tip of the right ninth caustic cartilage in the transpyloric line. What are the other structures crossed by transpyloric plane? Body of first lumbar vertebra, pylorus of stomach, hyla of kidneys, duodeno-jejunal junction, termination of spinal cord in adults, neck of pancreas, second part of duodenum, tip of ninth costal cartilage. What about the peritoneal attachments? The fundus of girl bladder is completely covered by peritoneum, but rest is partially covered by peritoneum. Tell me about the blood supply of girl bladder. Cystic artery, which usually arises from right hepatic artery, is the main source of arterial supply to girl bladder. It is also supplied by arteries from girl bladder bed. Girl bladder is drained by cystic veins which open into right branch of portal vein. A small part of it is drained by veins joining with tributaries of hepatic vein. What are the anatomical relations of gallbladder? Anteriorly, anterior abdominal wall, inferior surface of the liver, posteriorly, transverse colon, first and second parts of duodenum, on left side, caudate lobe of the liver, common hepatic artery, stomach, first and second parts of duodenum. On right side, right lobe of the liver. What are the boundaries of calot triangle? What does it contain? Calot triangle is formed by cystic duct, common hepatic duct, and inferior aspect of the liver. Cystic artery is constantly found in it. What is the difference between blood supply to gallbladder and blood supply to appendix? Appendicular artery is the only arterial supply to appendix, so appendix is grand green when appendicular artery is thrombosed. But gangrene of gallbladder is rare because even if cystic artery becomes thrombosed, 
there's secondary artery supply coming from liver bed. Can you tell me the cause of common bile duct? Common bile duct is formed by the union of cystic and common hepatic ducts. It runs downwards and backwards first in the free margin of the lesser omentum, then behind the first part of the duodenum. Then it lies behind the posterior surface of pancreatic head and opens into major papilla of duodenum with pancreatic duct.